Hey guys, miss you so much. I hope you guys are doing well. Today in reading, we're going to be looking at the escape poem that is inside your packet. It's also um, uploaded onto Google Classroom. So this text or this poem goes along with the passage that Miss DiCarlo read to you yesterday. Um, so think back to the main characters from yesterday's reading, Carl and Casper. Those are gonna be the main characters in this poem as well. So really quick, I want you to pause the video in just a second and label um, the stanzas and draw a line break. So I want you to pause. Promise me that you're pausing. Okay, so you should have uh, two stanzas and one line break in between. So today, as we read, as I read the text, I want you to read the text along with me. Circle any words you do not understand or do not know. Um, there's only two stanzas. It's not a very long poem. Um, after each stanza, I'm going to ask that you draw a really quick visualization just to kind of get your brain going to figure out what's happening in the poem. So I'm going to start reading with you. Two strong and brave men were locked in a cell for fighting the prince and his menacing men. One man was injured, the other stayed well, but both swore they'd rise up and do it again. The whale man, he picked at the lock of the door and then faced a choice, leave his sick friend behind. The whale man, he knew that would lead ever more to making a cage of his own guilty mind. A word in that passage that you may not know is the word menacing. Hopefully you would be able to look at your context clues and determine that menacing is another word for dangerous, but the definition is to put in danger of harm or injury. So this tells us that the prince and his men were probably not very good people. And by using the text Mr. DiCarlo read you yesterday, we knew they were stealing all the food. So today, um, hopefully you paused the video and drew, did two visualizations, one for stanza one, one for stanza two. If you did not do that, please go back and do so. Um, for today's work, I want you to answer questions five, six, and seven, A and B. Um, you can type your answers in the Google Doc that will be located um, on today's work or you can write them on your packet and send them to us, um, upload the pictures to Google Classroom either way. We miss you so much. Hope you're doing great. Hope to see you soon. 